Let's into our newsroom for the 36th Congressional District race. KMIR 6 News anchor Thalia Hayden joins us with the very latest. Thalia, what do you have for us? Well, the Riverside County Registrar's Office just put out the new numbers. Dr. Ruiz's lead just keeps growing. The latest numbers show him leading by 7,268 votes, which is up several thousand from earlier numbers. He now has a solid 4% lead. Here's the current breakdown with 100% of the precincts reported, but not all ballots officially counted. Dr. Raul Ruiz now has a stronger lead with 52% of the votes, while Congresswoman Mary Bono Mack has 48%. We have had several questions into our newsroom as to why this process is taking so long and what happens now. Last night, we made a trip to the Riverside County Registrar of Vot Voters Office, where staff was processing the vote by mail ballots. Registrar of Voters Carrie Virgil says they will start reviewing the provisional ballots after that. It is important to note that all of the ballots being counted aren't necessarily for the 36th Congressional District. They are county-wide ballots. The uh, canvas process is a legally required process, so we are auditing all of the ballots and also the rosters from the polling places and following all the election laws, and that's why it takes so long to certify an election. But when it comes to the 36th Congressional District seat, the Secretary of State does not list this race as a close race. Bono Mac has yet to concede, so the counting for the 36th District will continue. The results of the race will remain undetermined until every last ballot is counted. Again, Ruiz now has a solid 4% lead. It looks like the registrar's office got through about 41,000 ballots, which is twice as many as they got through yesterday. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Thaw.